Hey guys, I'm going to show you four ways that you can find really good niche ideas, okay? And these are from YouTube channels. I'm going to do a demo of that in a second. And I'll show you how you can automate this and find great ideas for niches in under five minutes, okay, using software. The second one is using Wikipedia. I'll give you a step-by-step -step guide on that as well. It will be a, a short example, but you will see exactly what you need to do there. The third way is using a free keyword research tool that will help you to discover a whole bunch of niches and subtopics that you haven't even thought of before. And the fourth one is using one of my tools called VidSpy Alpha. And VidSpy Alpha will basically um, give you broken links that have got um, expired domains that you can go and purchase immediately. So you can use those for doing 301 redirects or building a new blog or whatever you like so that you can get the traffic from YouTube if it's still flowing from there. But more importantly, you will have some expired domains with some um, previous history and some backlinks. Okay, so let's get into this. And first of all, we're going to look at the YouTube channels. Okay, to do that, I'm gonna use a tool I uh, call Vid Curate Alpha. This is a fantastic tool. This is the most powerful uh, playlist tool for YouTube on the market. Okay. Um, there are other tools, but it, they don't come close to this. What I'm going to show you is just one small piece of what we can do with Vid Curate. So, what I'm going to do is click in here to create a new project under the playlist builder. Now, when I do this, it's going to give me some research capabilities that are very very useful for what we want to do i'm just going to fill in these fields here so that we can keep moving and i'll just click on add a project now that i've done that what i can do is come over into this tab here that says playlist items and i can go and search and add okay i've got two screens here that's why i'm moving this across okay what i'll do is i'm going to search by the keyword Okay, and you can see we've got some advanced section here as well that we can do. We can find videos that have been uploaded in the last hour, today, last week, uh, this month, this year, or we can just leave it, okay? For an evergreen niche like this, I'm just going to leave it. But if you wanted to go de uh, to dig deeper for the, the length of the videos and uh, video license, etc., you can go and knock yourself out with this tool and be able to do that. So what I'll do is I'll click on search. And I'll click it a second time. That happens sometimes with this. Okay, now what I can do here is I can simply order this by the views. Okay, so you can see here, this top one has got a huge amount of views. Okay, it's got um, 890, in fact, that's 8.19 million views, I think. Okay, what we can do then is we can check box some of these so that I can pull them into the video dashboard where we do the work for creating the playlist with this one. Okay, I'll just take a few of these. And final one. Okay, now I'll import the selected data. After I have imported this, what I can do is I can right click and send to channel spy. Okay, when I do that, I get instantly information about what videos this guy has on his channel and how many views it's getting. We can also see when it was published as well. So what I can do is I can sort this by the viewers and you can see that the most popular videos, what their subtopics are, okay? So this can give you a huge amount of ideas around a base niche or base topic that you were working with or that you were interested in. For example, I have done a YouTube channel for plantar, plantar fasciitis. Now, I have already driven tens of thousands of views to that channel with all free traffic just by putting six videos into the channel. So if I want to go and create similar channels, this is a great way for me to be able to go and find some topics and subtopics for being able to do that. Okay, so that's a quick and easy way. Let me just do one more of these so you can see um, just how powerful this is. We can see here this channel here, what's new in orth orthopedics. So I can click on that, go to Channel Spy, and again, sort it by the views. And again, we can see exactly which videos and which topics are driving the most traffic. Okay, this can give you great insight. And that all done 
in just a few minutes, okay? Under five minutes for sure. Okay, I'm gonna close this now and I'll come back to it later for myself. Now, the next way we're gonna do Wikipedia. What you can do with Wikipedia is you can put in your keyword. You can see here, I've got plantar fasciitis. And you can see here, we've got the contents down here. This is giving us immediately some references that we can use. And also you can see all these hyperlinks here. Okay, you can see the anchor text being used in these hyperlinks. That gives you a huge amount of information. And the best part of this is when you get down to the bottom down here, you will see these categories. And these categories can give you some great ideas for foot diseases, disorders of fascia, etc., overuse injuries. All this kind of stuff can give you huge amounts of information and some great ideas for channels. So if I open one of these, you can see the category has got a whole bunch of different ideas here that we can use. We can go and create YouTube channels around these. If you don't know how to do that, I'm going to show you a tool that automates them all in a single click. Okay, even creating the videos, uploading the videos, doing the optimization on the videos and driving traffic to the videos. Okay, so you will be able to see that in action if you stay to the end of this video. Okay, so that's the Wikipedia example. And now what we're going to do is have a look at the third option. And that is free keyword research tool. So this is another one of my tools, keywordintense.io. Okay, I'll just open this up. And this is a fantastic tool for giving you huge amounts of ideas. I'll come in here and I'm going to put in here uh, the keyword plantar fasciitis. Okay, now I'll just click on submit. And there's other things that you can do here. You can go and find by different filters like how to's and most and ideas, etc. I just use this main one because it gives me a whole bunch of different ideas. Okay, so you can see here for the, my plantar fasciitis channel, I've got huge amounts of ideas in here. And we got some search volume, etc. as well. And you can see that there are in seconds lots of new ideas for new videos that I can do. Okay. It's kind of um, it's kind of endless to all these different ideas that we got in here. What I can do as well is I can take the idea from um, Wikipedia from that category for Wikipedia. I can put that in there as well, and it's going to give us a huge amount back as well. Now let's do another one. Let's say I was doing for SEO tools for those that are more familiar with the SEO stuff. This will be um, easier for you to see at a glance just the power of how, how powerful this is. And you can use this as a free keyword tool. You can get up to 250 results from a free search, okay? And you can do as many searches as you want. You can just open new tabs and do huge amounts of searches. And you can see here that we're getting a lot of keyword research um, done and the results coming back don't have the words SEO tools within them, okay? These are semantic keywords. And you can see things like backlink checker, other suggest, etc. Um, and you can get some ideas. That's how good this particular tool is. And you can use it absolutely free if you want to. Okay. Now the fourth is using a tool called Vids by Alpha. And I've already done a search with this, so I'll just show you the results from this because it takes a while. It has to go scraping, etc. And um, what you can see here, I've done one for angelfish. And this has pulled back a whole bunch of broken links that have got domains available that you can right click and go over into Namecheap or GoDaddy and purchase immediately, okay? You can see what's available. It's also gonna tell you how many views it's had, um, how many likes, how old that video is, okay? The newer it is, the more likely it is to still have traffic being driven to it, okay? So you can siphon off some traffic perhaps from YouTube. You can see the domain authority, the page authority as well for um, these websites, okay? And also you can see um, the Moz Trust as well if you put the Moz API key in there, okay? You can also see spam score, how many links they've got, et cetera, as well. Okay, it will also give you in blue, you will see there's some Web 2.0 sites pop up now and again as well. It's not a Web 2.0 um, expires account finder or anything like that, but you will see from time to time these pop up just a bit of research for Twitter, Tumblr, Blogspot, etc. Okay, this is a great way for being able to find expired domains. That means you can go and redirect them to your web pages. 
okay? Now, the way 301 redirects work is supposed to pass through the link just to wherever you're pointing it to, okay? And that can work as well for YouTube videos, okay? Why would, why would it work for WordPress but not YouTube videos, okay? It would work for YouTube videos. It's the same principle. It's just where you're pointing those backlinks, okay? So you can use that to actually send um, backlinks to your YouTube channel, okay? So this is all good and well, but how do you create content and how do you create content for so many ideas well we have a tool and it's called niche blaster niche blaster is a fantastic tool this tool does everything in just about one click okay and what we can do is we can create videos using chat gpt to write the video titles the video scripts the video description get the keywords the hashtags and all that good stuff and what the software does is it will go and create videos from those titles and that video script with some stock footage image okay uh, images and then it's going to upload those videos into uh, youtube but also it's using realistic text to speech voices okay and we use 11 labs is the best one that we're using it's realistic voices and it can give you some great videos um that that really are hard to tell that they are from a software okay so um this is really powerful stuff i've done demos on this particular tool i put some links in the description but this is the bonus tip if you want to be able to knock these out fast you can do that you can knock these channels out very very fast and just to prove how well this can work i'm going to open up here um an example you can see i already have a channel here for plantar fasciitis i put this up just a few weeks ago and you can see already it's got 38,408 views okay that's all free traffic guys all free traffic and you can see here for the videos that they've got likes etc one of them's got 29,000 views i mean who would who would bet against chat gpt being able to create some content that appeals to a lot of people in a nation that you don't even have to know anything about okay this is fantastic stuff it's really powerful stuff you need to watch the demo video for niche blaster to see just how quick and easy this is it's literally one click it does a whole lot the software does the whole lot in the background and these videos are good so let's go and have a look at one of them and you can see this one here we'll have a look at that since it's got nearly thirty thousand views what is plantar fasciitis hi and welcome to our plantar fasciitis channel. In this video, we're going to discuss what plantar fasciitis is, what causes it, and what the most common symptoms are. Okay, so you can see good quality voices, very, very simple videos, but very effective videos as well. These are great for what I call niche poking. Okay, it's kind of similar to keyword poking, only we're doing this for niches and we're finding niches that we can drive traffic so that we can double down on those niches and build an audience and monetize. Okay, so being able to do this all in a single click from niche blaster makes a hell of a difference to be able to do this very very quickly and very very easily and just to see the analytics for this i'm going to refresh this so you can see this is real okay and you can see down here thirty-eight thousand six hundred and ninety views all free traffic guys i haven't sent any youtube ads i haven't bought any um fiverr traffic box things okay this is suggested videos um browse features channel pages youtube um features and you can see we've got very very little coming from youtube search which is an opportunity because we can really ramp that traffic up from you youtube's uh, search as well and so that gives you an idea of being able to go and get um niche ideas that are working you can see it's working on other people's channels you can see what's working for them you can see what's driving traffic and also you can use wikipedia to go and find some more niche ideas and plus you can use keyword intent free keyword tool to double down on a specific niche and get a whole bunch of semantic keywords and subtopics that you can pick up some ideas for more videos etc and also what we can do then is create the content in a single click if you want to see that video and how these videos and how these entire channels are created in a single click then click on the link in the description that is linking to the niche blaster demo video okay it's only a 10 minute video you can watch it to x speed and let's see this thing in action this is incredible powerful software thanks